everyone welcome to automation community in this session we are going to see about word shift in omron plc so here we are going to shift a word word means 16 bit data that have to be moved from one location to another location for every pulse so this is the instruction we are having wsft and the short uh, number is 016 for this instruction and here we are having source word okay so which data you want to shift that one you have to put it in this address and from where to where so there should be some starting and ending address right so within that range only you are going to do the shifting operation so that address you have to give the starting address and the ending address so for every pulse you are giving it is moving to one address one by one it will move for every pulse all right so this is how it will work it will shift the data from source address to the starting address and it will move to the next address of the starting and like that it will move for every pulse and it will end at the destination address without any further delay we'll see this instruction in the software so the short form is WSFT. Let's see that. Let's take one input. So what is the short form? WSFT. So it's a word shift. So I'm going to give that in the source address D100. And what is going to be my starting addresses? Let it be some random address. And the ending address I'm giving is 205. Okay. So let's connect the run. So to monitor this, I'm going to take a help from a watch window. So in this watch window, I'm going to give the source address, starting address. And up next the starting address up to 205 I'm going to have. Okay, 206 also I'll have. Alright. So let's go for the simulation. It's getting ready to do the simulation. So just drag this so that we can see the Close this. All right. Fine. So let's give some value to our uh, source. So the value is in the hexadecimal. So I'm giving 100. It will be the 64. So this is the hex and this is the decimal. I mean binary. All right. So I'm giving 100. In the decimal, uh, that means uh, 64 as a hexadecimal data is in the address of D100. So I'm going to give the input so that the data have to be copied to D200 up to D204 for every pulse. Okay. Sorry, it's 205. So let's give the pulse. So look at this. All the data are occupied with the source address data. In this video completely I have mentioned one word called pulse. Alright. So pulse means what? A single shot. A single rising edge. Correct. But here I have given the continuous input. That's what it is occupied by all data. Okay. So let's turn off this. And get a single shot. So this is the rising edge, right? So let's go for the simulation. So that now you can see the difference. So for that, I have to make all these data to zero again. I can change here itself.
from here i'm going to add one more address the app next address so yeah then so let's do this now i'm going to give one single shot so for the one single shot the starting address d200 value is changed from 0 to 64 hex value okay 0 to 100 so we'll give the next pulse so for every pulse it will do one shift see now d201 so one more next next address is getting filled let's see up next so there should be some limit for this no and that limit is given by our end verb the address you are giving in the end verb no that will take care of it see now it's in a 204 now for one more pulse it will move to 205 after that what will happen you see see 205 is done so the value is filled at 205 now increase to one more pulse but you cannot see the shifting happening over there because the end word is 205 okay so this is how you know shifting of word will be happening in Omron PLC. so for every pulse you have you can able to shift so let's do one more thing now let's make this value to zero okay so imagine you are okay let's make everything to zero from beginning we'll do imagine you are having some data in 204 already okay and even 205 also some value you, you just give so now if i give a pulse what will happen we'll see so already 205 is having some hexadecimal value 55 so let's give one one pulse can you see here the first data the first address d200 is filled with the shifting the data which uh, the data which are we are having in the source but what happened to our d205 the value is vanished the, the data is lost the data in 204 is shifted to 57 i'll do one more time i'll give some value to d204 okay now i give a trigger you see this 54 will get 57 will get lost 22 will move to 205 check out this can you see okay now this data the data comes to 201 so this is how shifting will be happening in homegrown plc i hope you have understand the concept kindly like and subscribe our channel for more instructions like this in Omron PLC. I'll meet you in a session. Thank you.